With respect to the new equipment that, that has been purchased uh, through the foundation, um, it essentially includes a full ca cardiac catheterization suite which uh, includes the x-ray equipment, um, all the technology and, and um, the control panels for that equipment as well as some new features um, including intravascular ultrasound and um, additional abilities to do evaluations of coronary arteries that we previously have not been able to do. Uh, we went to the Cleveland uh, Clinic in, which is world leading in, in cardiac care and wanted to show us their state-of-the-art uh, cardiac cath lab that um, that they would be installing, sort of show us the place where they were going to put it and uh, the type of machinery that they had purchased but not yet received. And it was nice to tell them that um, here in Regina that that equipment had already been bought, installed and was being used. So they were in amazement. We felt pretty good about um, what we'd done and what uh, HRF had helped us do uh, to uh, get those pieces of equipment. Over the last number of years, we've been consistently able to show that our outcomes following heart attack or myocardial infarction have been as good as anywhere in the country, and, and in fact, in a lot of cases, at the top of uh, that scheme. And having this new equipment allows us to basically maintain that position and keep pushing harder to try and uh, continue to do um, as good a job as we have been able to do for patients over the last number of years. If you're going to have a heart problem, you want to be in Regina, absolutely. and. Uh, and this, uh, and this cath lab and, uh, and this cardiosciences uh, team here at the General will, uh, will give you uh, care and treatment that um, you, uh, you won't receive better anywhere else. So uh, we're, we're very proud of the team and, and what we've, uh, what we've uh, received for equipment. What I'd like to say to all the people that have donated in the past to um, the HRF um, and specifically to the Cardiosciences program, a big thank you. I'd encourage people to continue on donations in the future. There's always a need for updated equipment and it will continue to allow us to do the best possible job that we can for the patients of our community.